Good morning guys. Time is 5 o'clock in the morning. I am in a town called Grand Prairie in Canada. It's a bit up north, very close to the Rocky Mountains. I've been here now for three days working and before that I was working in Calgary for three days. But that is all over now. Now it's time to find some epic skiing. Let's go! Seems like I'm very lucky nowadays when it comes to skiing. It is dumping down today and I hope it will be the same in the place I'm going to. This place over here, the Rocky Mountains. Woohoo! The target of today is to go to the Powder Highway, one of the most famous places in Canada for skiing, or the most famous place for skiing in Canada and uh, where I can find like 10 really epic skiing resorts. I have not quite decided where to go yet, uh, if I start with sunshine or if I'm going to kicking horse, but uh, let's see. Summer, but now the winter is back. Really nice place, this Sunshine Village. It is actually three different mountains or three different ridges that are connected together, and you can basically ski all around them all. Lots of off piste skiing, there are also some fairly good tree skiing here. Yeah, huge area, really nice place. Like it, I love it. Panorama, 
great place. Now it's time to go back to the rental car and drive the one and a half hour to Kicking Horse on the Powder Highway, a place that I've been looking forward to come back to since Cal and I was there three years ago it was. So let's do it. Welcome, welcome to my room here in Golden. Skiing gear all over the place, as you can see, and now delicious dinner, and also a very nice view over the zoo. Yes, and lots and lots of camera equipment. Second day of skiing here in Canada. Uh, the morning didn't start so well. First of all, I closed the door of the car on the uh, strap of the bag, so it basically went into a million pieces. And then I drove away from the parking lot with the coffee on the roof of the car. That didn't turn out so well. But that is all forgotten now, because now I'm really hitting up to the uh, Kicking Horse Mountain. Uh, I've been dreaming to come back here for a long, long time. And I'm really looking forward for the kick-ass skiing that I'm going to have today. Um, let's go! It seems like I'm lucky today as well. We have like 5 centimeters of fresh powder here at the base. And it's gonna be probably around 10 to 20 in the top. It's gonna be a beautiful day. Now I just need to sort out my rental skis and then I'm good to go. is to get back to the skis it is waist deep here and i don't know how to get up there but whoa snow and it's so much fun so I don't have any time to post the channel video. One of the reasons why I wanted to go back to Kicking Horse was actually to see if it is as good as we thought two or three years ago comparing with Japan and that kind of stuff. It is as good as Japan. Maybe even better. I love this place. It is totally amazing. 
Totally amazing. The best thing with these places that had gondolas is actually that you can heat up a little bit, you can arrange your equipment in between the runs, and you can also have some food. Of course, today with all this powder, there is no way I'm going to a restaurant. So, yesterday I prepared, I bought a sandwich and a Coke, I had it in a bag, and I had a meal here in the gondola. Perfect, I saved half hour, and now I can run a lot more powder. However, actually, I don't think I can take so many more runs. Two more, that's it. Then I'm finished for the day, that's for sure. This is tough on your body. this time this was a very nice premiere of this skiing season that's for sure I'm driving back to Calgary now and then I go back home for good and for bad I could definitely have stayed here a couple of days but I miss the people back home so now I really need to go back and um, if you decide to go to Canada for skiing you should definitely pick Kicking Horse this is such a good place uh, I've been to a couple of places and this is for sure the best one. That's it for this time. See you next time. This is so sad. It is still hammering down snow. And I need to go back home. <sighs> well, that's life. <sighs> See you next time.